Hey everybody I'm starting to get more familiar with my new Bamboo Lab H2D and today I'm going to do a video on how easy it is to switch between the 3D printing module to the cutting module. With the cutting module you are able to cut paper, heat transfer vinyl, leather and fabric. Today I will be using it to cut transfer vinyl. First things first you need to shut off the machine. It is important to always shut off the machine before changing all modules. Next you need to remove your AMS2 Pro from the top glass and remove the glass. The next step is to remove the heat bed as you will replace it with the adhesive cutting bed. Now you are ready to install the cutting module. First you will need to remove the tool head cover on the 3D printing module. This will give you access to the mounting rails. You can then gently slide on the cutting module to the tool head mount. Once the cutting module is securely attached you will plug it into the power port. You can remove the dust cover and plug in the module. Now you place the adhesive plate to prepare for cutting. Be sure to remove the film on the correct side of the board. There is high adhesive side and weak adhesive side to the tray depending on material. Next remove the safety cover from the cutting tool. You are then ready to place your cutting material on the board. It is then time to run calibration. Just kidding. The H2D is really good at letting you know you have done something incorrectly. You must first run calibration before placing your cutting materials. Now is his time to correctly place your cutting materials on the board face down. This is where you can use the bamboo suite to create your design. I have found this part of the process to be creative and fun. You will send your file to the printer that will then prompt you to push the start button on the physical machine. As soon as you press the button the H2D will begin the cutting process. My design was simple with words and two images. This took a total of three minutes to complete. You can now remove your cut from the adhesive board. I found this process to be simple and the outcome was crisp and clean. Make sure you subscribe to my channel for more how to with the H2D. Comment with any suggestions or questions.